Hey, it's Matt at Rough House Studios, and welcome to my review of the Herba Viva Dryer Vaporizer. I would like to thank the guys at Aris for setting up and sponsoring this review. If you'd like to learn more about the Viva or many of their other products, please check out aristechshop.com. Now let's take a look at what comes in the box with the Herba Viva Dryer Vaporizer. We have the little felt container that comes with a lot of Aristex products. It's kind of cool to have that. It's an instruction manual. And there's an accessories box that includes the USB charging ribbon, a cleaning brush, a little packing tool. Then there is the Viva vaporizer itself, which is a very compact design. This vaporizer will definitely fit in the palm of your hand. And looking forward to testing it out. Now let's take a closer look. At the heel of it, we have the USB charging cord. Then we have the up and down arrows to set the temperature, the power button. There's also an OLED display screen. We'll see more about that when we actually get to the functions and features. We also have the air vents right at the top of the vaporizer right underneath where the mouthpiece comes off. So I like that. I like when the air vents are close to the chamber, which inevitably is going to be right underneath this cap on the mouthpiece. And there it is. It's a large ceramic chamber with the air flow right at the bottom of the chamber there. And then at the other side, we have the metal screen that puts at the bottom of the vaporizer. It's a plastic cap. And then at the bottom of the device, there is the actual USB micro charging port. And that's it, that's on the heel. Now we're gonna take a look at the functions and features. First, we're gonna charge it with the micro USB plugged in the bottom there. It flashes red to indicate that it's charging and there's a battery indicator on the OLED display as well. Now that we have it fully charged, we power it on. You can see as soon as you cut it on, it immediately starts racing up to the set temperature. It remembers the last temperature that it was set at. And you set the temperature up and down with the up and down arrow button, obviously. The temperature on this goes down from 300 degrees and all the way up to 435 degrees. And then you hold down the power button and the down button and it'll switch it to Celsius. Really, really simple device to operate and I love that you can control the temperature precisely. And we've got some cannabis ground up here and we're going to jump into the actual usage and testing. So first we're going to pack it up and with vaporizers, we're using a nice even grind and we're going to pack it just very lightly finger tight, not really very firmly packed inside. All right, and this is the fun part of the job here. We're going to get it fired up. And this thing, it gets hot really fast too, so it only takes like a minute or less to get all the way up to 400 and something degrees. I'm testing it at the high temperature at first and then I'm going to find that it's a little too hot for my throat and I pack it off a little to 420 and then I finish it off back at 435 for the last couple of minutes of the vaporizer. It auto cut off after about five minutes. It's got a 2200 milliamp battery so you find plenty of battery life out of this thing and uh, you can tell by my eyes that it really <laughs> did an effective job. And the taste was good. There was no problems with the taste. And now we're gonna take a look at the actual performance of it. And you can see it did a really excellent job of vaporizing the cannabis. It's nice and even, no issues with scorching whatsoever, and no issues with too much green left over. It did about a 90, 95% job of that. So the Herba Viva has got big ceramic chamber, compact, durable, sleek design. It's really super easy to use. I love that full range temperature control. And it's only $59 on sale, excellent entry level value. And the cons are for me is that the bubbler that I had was broken when I tried to put it on. Although that would have been covered under a warranty, I didn't get to test it. But otherwise I'm giving it four and a half stars. It's a really great entry level vaporizer. So if you're interested in checking it out, please visit aristechshop.com and you could see the Herba Viva and many other other types of vaporizers that they have there. Quite a few different for wax and for dry herb. Hope you enjoy this review. Please visit roughhousestudios.com for hundreds more cannabis culture videos made just for you. This is Matt for Rough House Studios. Thank you for watching. Mm -hmm.